We're here with an icon in the industry. He's been a club maker for a very, very long time. Roger, it's a real honor. Let's talk about wedges here. First of all, so many years ago, I mean, you were basically almost the, the creator of the current wedge design. Maybe you can talk about the evolution of, of technology there. Well, there's, you know, you don't want a fast face in a wedge. So, but there is an evolution, and, and uh, the evolution is in the, the sole, the different grinds that, that we have and, and what we present uh, the golfer today. And, uh, and it's because of the type of uh, swing characteristic, characteristics that they have and the conditions that they play in. So Wedge 101 then, if you could explain, you know, what kind of player and what kind of turf uh, gets different bounce. Maybe I should talk about what bounce is, first of all. And, and a lot of people uh, don't understand it. And, and what, what the pros do so well is use it, okay? And so if I, if I hold the club up with the shaft at 90 degrees, the trailing edge is lower than the leading edge, and that angle is the bounce angle. And that acts as your skid plate, okay? That's your friend, you wanna use it, okay? Um, because th this is the shortest club in your bag, you're gonna have the steepest attack angle or the tightest arc in your swing, and so you need more of this than you do in a five iron, okay, which is longer, so you're gonna be more shallow. Or just be a shovel, right? Yeah, or just the leading edge would just be a shovel. And you, the leading edge is not your friend, okay? The sole is, and so it's very key. And so what we have done over the course of, uh, of years is develop different types of soles, okay, for different conditions. So we have, we have three different geometries on the soles of, of our lob wedges. We have a, a C grind, which has a lot of relief, and it's really good for firm conditions or if you want to open the face up and do a lot of things around the green. We have an S, which is pretty just standard for a shallow entry person that's pretty shallow. Still has enough relief in the heel that you can open it up, but the C is a little bit more extreme. And then we have a new wedge with a, a wide sole, okay? And that's for, for uh, softer conditions and if you're pretty steep into the ball. So it's a little wide, it acts like it has more bounce, very forgiving. You have to have bounce. You have to have a minimum of 8 to 12 degrees of bounce in your lob wedges. That's what the pros play with. So, I mean, obviously the technology is very important, you know, and, and, and be fit for the right wedge. and Get fit. Go take some lessons, though. It's really, I mean, in the, instead of going and, and, and it's, it's so, it, the, the technique of the short game is way different than your long game technique. you got to get that the club in the position so quickly to use the sole. And it's really fun to do that. And, and once you learn that, you, you can, uh, you'll, you'll lower your handicap, which is good. As a golf instruction company, I can say we definitely believe in that. So very good information, Roger, really appreciate it. Best of luck to you guys moving forward. Yeah, this is an honor, thank you. Swing better, play better, golf tech.